Hey guys and welcome to today's tutorial on how to build bridges in Scania Truck Driver Simulator. It's again a requested video and um, if you want to know something just ask. I love making videos that are requested at least someone will watch them. Okay right I opened a little project I was busy with but there are some serious bugs I cannot get out so I stopped with this map but as you can see I've built some bridges one two and there is number three and well they are all like a bit different this for example should be a motorway bridge as you can see I actually like this one very much how I made it and uh, this is just a very easy bridge this is mm, the simplest way to make a bridge without using the prefab bridge of course and this is a little bridge I made and I like that one as well it's a bit old you know old road etc it's it's very great that you can use your imagination anyway let's start so well uh, what did I do with every bridge well this is just the bridge and I put an anti-noise wall next to it. It's very simple. This one it takes not even two minutes to make and this one is just as easy. So well I will just start over here where delete this little stretch of road and I will make a bridge from there to there. Alright first you just take like a road. Wait I will take just a piece of road hopefully it doesn't crash because there are some serious problems but doesn't matter let's see alright this is a bit fucked up this piece of road uh, let's make it again so this time the road is a little bit better so now we got our stretch of road great uh, what you do now is press P mic. Press P and you will get to your road item properties. This is what you need. So first of all what you need to do is the quad count put them on zero. You know a bridge doesn't often have grass next to it. Then you go to railing and you go here. Bridge simple like with a sidewalk by four meters. Normal bridge. This is a prefab bridge for motorway two lane bridge, one way, two lane, a uh, one way motorway, two lanes. Oh, that's anti noise wall. Anyway, uh, well, you would think, uh, well, it looks shit from the top. For example, just take this one. That looks shit if you're looking from here. Yes, I know, but that's not the key thing. Look, it looks like a normal bridge. That's so freaking handy about this. So well, um, let's go back to properties. And as the bridge says, it's a sidewalk four meters. So just make city road, make a sidewalk. No, a no, no, it's perfectly fitting. Well, great. We made our own bridge. Yes, that's that's quite easy. So, um, how to make this bridge? the one with those two posts etc. Uh, just add oh wait first go to properties again set as default and just make some extra road pieces um, move 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 that one in there as well move there so I want a bit better overview. Let's make it a bit straight. It's often quite hard to get a straight bridge if you didn't put the road pieces in a straight line. So, well, this is about the middle. Those two are a bit in the water, and this is at the other side. So, what we got now is just normal looking bridge. Right. Um, what I'm going to do now is press P over here and now go to model and well I press T, just press T it goes a lot quicker uh, 
Uh, no, don't press T. Where is it? Here, pillar. You have Cardiff Bridge, but that's too big. H-shaped, T-cylinder or T-shaped. You can choose whatever you want. Model offset, please make sure it's zero. Model distance, well, if you put like a two. Oh, wait, that looks pretty fucked up. Yes, I know. Um, Just put some... Oh, it's even 22. Just put a good number, like 50. Let's see. 50. What happens now? We got one pillar over here. No? It's okay. Um, Let's put one over here as well. Pillar. Was it T-shaped or T-cylinder? T-shaped, I think. I'm not sure even. Hey, here we go. Two pillars. You know, it it just adds some realism. As you can see underneath the water, it's a bit longer. Anyway, let's continue. Uh, because now, of course, you want to have this kind of shape. Well, it's very easy. Just press H. Look here, it's 8.93 the height, 8.93. Let's make the middle like, I don't know, 8, 20, about 20. Let's make this about 12 or something. Let's see how it looks now. Look, we got ourselves a kind of custom shaped bridge. Make any changes you like. So, well, you can do a lot more stuff, you know. Um, for example, what I did is adding an anti-noise wall. Anti-noise wall from glass, this one. Well, uh, it's not very hard, but you have to be very careful. You hold, first of all, the red dot, press on the side, then go to here and make sure you the it connects to the red dot over here again. This makes sure that it gets exactly the same height as the red node, as I should call it. And that makes sure that the wall is exactly on the bridge. Look at this. Looks quite fun, right? So, well, this is a very easy way to make some very cool looking bridges. And you can go nuts with your fantasy. Really, there is no way. Wait, delete this part. You can even, if you press P and go to railing and press like tunnel. This one? No, wait, this one. For example, look, a bridge and a tunnel in one. You know, you just just do whatever you want. Go nuts. As you can see. This is a little inspiration. If you guys can make something like this, then you are well already quite far with modding, you know, or making some tunnel like this. If if you want to know anything else, please leave something like a request. You know, just say yay. Uh, Nico is my name, by the way. Just say, Nico, could you make a video about this or this? Or if you have a problem, just just um, just make a screenshot or record the problem with Frops and make a video of it. Put it on YouTube and put it in a video reaction in one of my videos and just give a personal message like, help me, I don't know what's wrong here. Um, you know, I have time to spare. I can help everybody out if I want to and well as you can see I was busy with this map but I'm stopping now I'm now busy with the other map um, if I'm going to release it I don't know I'm just practicing this here look yeah well there are little errors but at least if you, you can kind of expect this is a kind of expectation you can have for the coming ETS2 game because I'm going to make here, like some roadworks here. Wow, great! Uh, I'm going to make a uh, a improvement map. I'm just practicing with this game. So, if you want to know everything before everyone else, 
for the ETS2 improvement map, just subscribe, you will get all the latest news. And of course, subscribe if you want to want to have more ETS or Scania truck driving or even GTS. I also did that tutorials on modding everything. GTA tutorials, I can also give some of those. Just ask. I'll give an answer. Cheers.